Hey guys, I'm Dee from Dee Love You Life. If you're new, welcome. I usually do hauls like CVS or something like that in my vlogs, but I figure that there are some of those who really enjoy watching hauls. And I haven't done like a Dollar Tree haul or a thrifting store haul. God, I miss those days. Hopefully we can get back to those. But as I live in California, we were again on shelter in place during that time. I took advantage of the grocery delivery from Target, Safeway, and just today I had to go run up to CVS with a little itty bitty of makeup haul and some other stuff. So stick around. All right. My Safeway grocery delivery just arrived. Let me unbag everything so you can see my Safeway haul. We'll first start off with my small Target delivery haul. They had their cheese on sale for this week for $1.99 for their um, shredded cheese. So I got one in Cheddar Jack so I can make my enchiladas with that. Mozzarella, two packages of mozzarella and then one Mexican style for our tacos. 12 ounce of green beans, fresh blackberries and strawberries. And these strawberries are huge, they're very delicious. We already got into those. <laughs> And also, I ordered uh, baby red potatoes. I really think this is a score for the size that I wanted. It's one and a half pound bag. It's like the perfect size. Uh, it's not too much where I'm not gonna have a lot left over, like Safeway. Sorry, Safeway. But I really like that size. That's perfect for the three of us. One head of cabbage. And for snacks, I picked out the lightly salted cashews, halves and pieces. My husband and mom really love cashews. And for Valentine's, well, not really for Valentine's, really for any type of day, my mom is a total Kit Kat lover. So I got her bag, a small bag that this is something new i've never purchased this one before this is bissell pet pro oxy stain destroyer permanently removes tough pet stains and odors so you know sometimes kitty spits up so i want to use that i'm going to give that one a go i don't know if you guys use this let me know in the comments down below so this is pretty much my target now here is my safeway order that just came in just now See, I was running low on my coffee, and I really like the Green Mountain Hazelnut coffee. These are the Craig's, so I got two of those for myself. And then one more, just in case, of my mom's decaf breakfast blend, the Signature Select. She enjoys that coffee. I also have some fresh mushrooms here, a dozen of eggs, because I just always need a dozen of eggs on hand, some broccoli florets to go for one of my meal plans for this week, along with the penne. So if you haven't checked out my meal planning video, I'll link it somewhere up there. I also got a 2% milk. Should have gotten, now I think about it, I should have gotten the gallon, but that's okay. We'll just stick with that for right now because I still have a little bit left in the previous gallon right now. To go with my penne and mushrooms and broccoli dish, hot Italian turkey sausage, one pack of the Ballpark Franks, and I have the croissant rolls, so I'm just going to roll those in there for lunch probably, maybe later today needed one more thing of sour cream applesauce for my mom she loves applesauce and then i got two of the hordes roasted salsa verde in the medium this is going to be for my chicken enchiladas for tonight i have two raisin brands my mom likes the one with cranberries so i got two of those i ordered some rice but it looks like they had to substitute two small ones for the one that I had originally ordered. And that's fine. So they got me two of those. These are just going to go right into my glass container in my pantry. And I have one loaf of sandwich bread. We're running really low on paper plates. So I grabbed this one. This is the value corner, 100 count. We just like to have that on hand. 
I bought one bag of the Lay's Classic. I normally like to order the variety pack, the smaller ones, but those were so expensive they weren't on sales, but this one was, so I decided to just grab one bag until I can make it to Costco. So I might just have to individually put them in like little snack bags for Jay's lunch. I don't know, I'll figure that out. And lastly, I got one bag of the five pound Idaho russet potatoes. All in all, that is it. Now everything is wiped down by my Clorox wipes and I just now had to put everything away and make notes to my food inventory that I like to keep track of for the freezer and pantry. And now my CVS haul. I wanted to jump on their deal. You spend 30, you get back $10. Part of their sale was buy two body wash two for 13 so i got one for jay my husband the extra fresh micro moisture poor guy i've been making him take a shower when he comes home from work so he's like taking double showers to see if he wants to use the micro moisture body wash it smells amazing though a dove body wash for my mom she really likes the dove and so this one is a deep moisture and then part of the spend 30 get back 10 is uh either gain or tide my CVS was pretty much cleared out of all the Tide. So I grabbed this. It was $4.94. Aroma Boost is really good. That's what I hear. So I'm kind of curious how this is going to smell. Out of curiosity, I got that. A $2 coupon, so it was only $2.94. I made the mistake. I thought this was L'Oreal, although I do like this one, but I wanted to get part of any L'Oreal facial products as part of the spend 30 get back 10 minus this I only have eight dollars more to get my ten dollars if I would have gotten the L'Oreal one I've already would have made the spend 30 get back 10 so I'm gonna go ahead and return this and get the right one to get my ten dollars it happens <laughs> Also part of the spend 30 get back 10 is the Honey Nut Cheerios and they had some other stuff like Lucky Charms and uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch or whatever but I like having the Honey Nut Cheerios with some fresh sliced bananas for mom and I. So these were $1.99 each so I grabbed two of those. I had a dollar off from a CVS coupon machine. So it was only $1.49 each. That's not bad at all. We're at a coffee creamer. So these were on sale at CVS. These were two for $6. Any type of Neutrogena facial product, you buy one, get one 40% off. You guys, these are my next, my second favorite. Uh, you know how if you guys seen my empties videos, you guys know that I like the Neutrogena foam cleanser because it goes ee, 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 ee. This is really good. I really enjoyed this. This is my new favorite facial cleanser. They were $10.29. This would have been $16.46, but then I had an additional $5 off of $15 in facial products, so it was even cheaper than that. It actually brought it down to $11.42, which is like five bucks and 70 some something each. So that was a really good buy. Probably one of my favorite color touch-up is a L'Oreal Paris Magic Root Rescue. It only takes 10 minutes, super easy. I'm in the color 4A, ash brown. I don't like the red tint in my hair, so I like to get the ash brown. So I got that one. Saved like 48 cents on this. It was only $7.81. I'm a caregiver, and so this is actually what I went for, but I got all this. <laughs> things that I need and it's on sale. All right, I splurged a little bit on this. This is like my colors, you guys. I cannot wait to use this. This is the Maybelline New York, the City Mini Palette, Brooklyn Nudes. It's so compact, it'd be great for taking little trips or whatever, and I really like the colors, they're so natural. This at my store was on sale for $10.99, but there's a deal, hold on. <laughs> This is brand new. This is called, it's by Maybelline. It's called Color Strike. 
and it's a 24 hour eyeshadow. I cannot wait to use this. The other stuff I'm using, it's Amber by L'Oreal. It gets on my fingers when I put it on my eyelids, so I'm really dying to try this. Even the girl at the cash register was like, oh, this is new. I'm like, I know, I cannot wait to try it. <laughs> so $10.99 and $8.99. I had a $4 off of 12 coupon from the um, extra care card. So it brought it down to $15.05 for both of those. But buying two Maybelline products, you get five bucks back. It was only $10 for both of those. Not bad. So I'm gonna go ahead and return this one to get my $10 off. So basically I spent 30 and get back my $10. So basically it was $20 for everything, pretty much. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like these type of videos, let me know by giving me a thumbs up and comment down below of are you doing any type of grocery delivery and if so, where? And I will see you on the next one. Bye.